statistics. Lowercase s statistics. A statistic is a function that takes in data and outputs a single number. Data is usually depicted as n observations, usually using x's as the notation. For many of us, the first statistic that we ever learn about is the sample mean. You sum up the observations and divide by how many there are. The sample mean is supposed to estimate the population mean, which we think of as the true mean. Another well-known statistic is the sample variance. For some reason, statistics are usually denoted by the letter T. Notice that it's a capital letter. Remember that when we collect data, we often assume that it is a realization of some random variable, but before we observe it, it's still random. So, a statistic is a function of random variables. This means that statistics themselves are also random variables. Why does that matter? This means that statistics have everything that random variables have. This includes distributions like the PDF, the CDF, expectations, mostly, and variances, mostly. This can be confusing because most of the time we only collect one data set and therefore can only calculate one statistic. How could there be a distribution if we only have one statistic? Remember that we consider the data to be random as well. To get the distribution, we need to go out and collect many, many datasets. Then we calculate the statistics from each of them. From these calculated statistics, we can rebuild the PDF of the random variable or the statistic itself. This distribution is so important that it has a special name, the sampling distribution. Don't let the fancy name distract you. In the end, it's still just a PDF, a PDF of a statistic. Major point alert, remember that the height of a PDF tells us how likely it is that we'll observe a realization from that PDF. This is one of the core ideas behind hypothesis testing, but that's for another video. This was the Pocket Stat on statistics. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.